everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm Football from Gaming here, and today I'm playing some more BC Battles 2. Uh, so today, we're actually gonna enter the next league. So we have 19 trophies right now. As soon as we reach 20, we'll be in Yellow Stadium. So that's, uh, well, that's something we're gonna do today. Uh, I also plan on buying most, if not all, of the characters. So first things first, Boomerang, Ice Monkey, Blue Gunner. So before you mention it, yes, I did not grind, so I actually can't afford all of these upgrades. Uh, but that's that's okay, right? We're fine. Maybe you will we'll maybe fine. Oh, okay, so yeah, we are short a fair bit of monkey money still, but we got we made pretty decent progress. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is we're gonna do some battle still. So we can't afford everything. We're still working our way towards buying all the towers, and then there's skins and all sorts of stuff. Yeah, I need to play more of this game, and I will, I promise, I will play more of this game off camera to get more items, but for the time being, we're just gonna be playing, uh, I'm gonna be playing with you guys. So now that I have so many more towers, do I actually wanna use any of them? You set me, you set me on fire, na na na. I'm pointing my finger at you then. Uh, no, I think we're probably fine. I still like this strategy, I just need to get more tower XP, and just a little bit better at this game. I still need some practice, definitely need some practice, but hopefully, as we play, I will continue to get it. Uh, but yeah, so we should get a couple matches in here, three, maybe four, depending on how long they are. Again, I would love to have a more late game run, but we'll see if it's gonna happen. Not the easiest map here, but not bad. We'll do a Quincy start into Buccaneer, because we do want to get that hero down pretty early for the XP. Um, so yeah, our opponent, there we go. I'm like, what are you doing? He went straight for Gwendolyn, which is interesting. I don't really see anyone do that, in part because she can't hold off red balloons. Neither can Quincy, to be fair, though. Uh, which is why you have got the power of a Buccaneer as well. You can't remove these, can you? You can actually remove the obstacle. That's a pretty decent obstacle to remove. Uh, so I could also save up the 550 for Great Shot, which I might go for. We'll see. Engineer. So this group's using Engineer. Okay. I know Engineers are very high pure, so I guess they would be pretty good for this game. Basically, a big rule of thumb for our BT Battles 2 is just anything with high pierce pretty good. Uh, so, I, yeah, Engineer pretty high pierce they'd be pretty good for this. Though, I don't know, it still doesn't look like he's doing all that great. Though, again, 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 neither am I, am, neither, neither am, neither am I. I don't know, I feel like I said that right, then I tried to repeat it three times. They person does have double guns, though, which means they have at least a third tier upgrade. Obviously, I do have some third tiers as well, but I'm slightly worried they're gonna throw it in a balloon trap, and I'm gonna be scared. Very scared. Also, blue balloons are here. I need to get better at sending those earlier. I need to get faster at sending those out, which unfortunately, I currently am not. Uh, but you know what? That's okay, because we got a cannon ship. A bit of a waste. Probably should have waited a few more rounds to do that, so I could have kept some more eco. Uh, but we should be good now. It's annoying me that I keep clicking on Quincy when I mean to be clicking on the Buccaneer. We did get our Quincy ability up, though, which is pretty nice. Uh, so I'll probably go, I guess, top path for the cannon ship. I'll just leave it unupgraded for now. We'll see if I can wait out. Because, uh, again, I have the village. I would go for camo village in the long run, but I don't know. I don't really know what's worth it in this game at this current point. There's so many things I can do, and I need to get, uh, I need to learn better, I guess. I need to learn when I should go for the village or when I should still just go for the main towers. Because the villages have the potential to be really powerful, but obviously they're support towers. Which means you can't use them on their own, unless it's a, you know, engineer or spike factor, which, or spike factory, which although, obviously still in support class, they're not, they're not really support towers. They sort of are, but not nearly as much. Also, can we actually hold off this green? Yeah, we're fine for the greens. I, we are not really holding it up in terms of eco, though. Uh, I'm a little suspicious of this dude holding off on sending balloons. Is it because he's leaking a little, or almost leaking to my green balloons? Probably the reasoning. Yeah, I just want to get the eco up. That's the main thing. I am interested in what his other towers are, because he's only placed the one, though I guess so have I, so, you know, neither of us really know much. Um, what was that? There was like a spike, a spike thing there. What was it? Was it just normal tax? I thought there was something, I saw something weird there. I guess I should still go for yellow balloons, though. I don't know if I can afford it. But I will try, not to mention, pretty sure he can't defend them, which means they're not exactly a bad play defense-wise either. Uh, but also, with that said, neither can I, so let's just get in a tax sprayer over here. Just a little bit of extra support. So he had to resort to using his ability, which, I mean, I sort of do too. Back to greens I go, because I really can't afford to keep this, or like, to keep that up. I do not have the income to do it. Um, 
He's also using boat. Not that surprising. Obviously, I show attack shooter. Uh, which I think this is a pretty good spot for them. I'm not positive. There's not a ton of great curves on this map, but this looks pretty decent. Uh, but unfortunately, I did spend quite a bit of money on that. And I'm still struggling to keep up. Oh, now there's pink balloons, too. There's so much eco I can send, but I just don't have the money to use it. Like, I want to put the money into the eco. But I also need to switch back to greens, because I can actually afford greens. Because I definitely can't afford to keep sending things out right now. I don't have the money for it in the slightest. So I'm just alternating between greens and pinks. Like, he was with, like, he has his double shot boat now. He's pretty good. I still, so yeah, this is my arena. In my arena, I still can't use camo, de like, camo detection, which I really hate. But it's just the case with my current arena, which is a little annoying again. But just the way it works right now. So I'm getting close to being able to send full pinks, which is pretty great. Like, I can go pretty low on cash and switch to greens. But I still need a bit more eco in order to go full on pink spam, which is too bad. Though we are getting pretty close to that, so I think I'm just gonna go ahead and try with the full on pinks for now. It'll be a little bit too weak to full on spam them. I need more defense, badly. Okay, double shot boat. We still have the tax shooter. Are we good? That was a lot of lives, and we did get first blood, but I think overall I'm okay. Yeah, I think we're good for now. Um, I am obviously trying to win this too, though. But I also kind of want to go late game. It's weird. Like, I'm probably trying to win this, but at the same time, I could probably zebra rush him. So you know what? That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a full on zebra rush. Okay, zebras, here we go. Throwing some ceramics in there, some rainbows. Uh, and then I am also going to go for a bit more defense, because I really need it. Uh, actually, can I beat him? He did tower boost, but he's still leaking a lot. He's dead, right? No, then he's using his Gwendolyn ability. That was good timing on his part. He might survive that. Yeah, it looks like he's good. Too bad. I did waste a lot of money on that, and I don't exactly have a ton of defense set up myself, if he decides to rush back. Though he still did leak lives. Like, I don't know. I feel like I could probably take him out with something like this, but... Um, let's just take it to the bit of a later game just for fun. I think that'll be better to try to go later game for it. I mean, or I could just save up and regrow, not regrow, just rainbow rush him, which I think is what I'm actually gonna do. I'll save up a little bit, head in for that, and it should actually be really, really well. Um, okay, I'll wait one more tick of money, and then in I go. In I go. Rush, full on rainbows, I can do it right. Just keep the rainbow spam. There's also ceramics. I'll throw in some ceramics in there. More rainbows. Um, pretty sure he can't handle this. He went destroyer. He has a lot of defense here, but there's a lot of offense on this end too. Lots of ceramics. But he's actually holding it out, and he survives. Okay, this is bad. I need to save defense. My defense is so bad right now. In a normal game, I would have died to camos already. I barely got away with not. Uh, I need destroyer. I'm going for destroyer as well. I definitely think I need to go for it. Um, I think I can go pink spam now in terms of eco, though, just barely, but I should be able to do it. He's definitely rushing me, yeah, not surprising. Ability, ability, I'm pretty sure I'm still dead, though, yeah. He beat me, that was... I played really badly there. I played really badly there. I should have rushed earlier, or I should have stopped after the first, like, one or two failed. That was bad. And now I need to win two, and now I need to win another game. To get to the next arena, and I lost a win streak, and... That was not good. I did not go well then. I can't believe I made so many mistakes there. That was... I'm looking back at it now. That was such a bad game. That really sucked. Well, I guess I will just have to try again then. This is bothering me now. I, I had to lose there, didn't I? I really did. Oh, this is the hard map. I don't really want to do this map. I want to do an easier one. Basalt Columns! Also a hard map, but you know what? I like it a little bit better. Um, I'll stick with the same strategy, I think. I think I'll I stick with it. Missed. I don't know. I never miss. <laughs> I kind of want to go for an earlier rush now, because I want to get into Yellow Stadium and do a game there, I think. That would be better. But at the same time, obviously, uh, I don't want to lose, which would kind of suck. Um, so Tax Shooter, not a bad idea. Lots of good Tax Shooter maps or spots on this map. Tax Shooters are still such good towers. Uh, I definitely defense straight away, though, so although I would love to rush him with rainbows, or with the reds, rather, uh, I also need to go for defense. But hopefully, I believe they loop, no, they don't loop. So yeah, he dropped first blood. Actually, I do first blood barely there. At which point, I immediately dropped another tax shooter for probably no good reason. I'll put another one up at front, it probably makes the most sense for now to just do the tax shooter spam. He has middle path tax shooters, oh no. 
This is not gonna end well for me, not in the slightest. Uh, next tax shooter! Just, come on, more tax, and I need more tax down here. This is not good. Not good in the slightest. I need... I really need to do a better job here, and there's so many ways to tax in my positioning. I should've put it on the inside, like, hey, and I put them on the outside, stupidly. Oh, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Inside tax shooters, then, just absolute tax shooter spam. It's not a bad strategy, but I don't really want to do it still. I am not playing well. It's been a while since I played this game, but even still, I am just not doing a good job with this run. With these matches so far, I have not done a good job in the slightest. My eco is terrible. My income is terrible. My defense is pretty darn bad. Oh, I don't like this. I really don't like this. He is lower lives than me, so I guess there's positive somewhere here, but definitely, definitely not good. Let's see if I can just- what happens if I just throw in some pinks there? I assume nothing's gonna happen, but it's hard to know for sure. Yeah, no. Nothing really happened with the pinks. Why were my attack shooters doing so badly there? I need more defense again. I don't want to keep going for defense. I want to have offense and defense at the same time. Uh, but I still- I still kind of need the defense. And I can't even afford anything because my ego's still so low. Oh, okay. Stop complaining. I need to stop complaining. I actually need to do something about this problem to try to solve it. So I guess I'll just invest in eco, I'll go for the greens, I'll try to go for a more late game run, which I think I can defend better. I'm not on the offensive, I don't want to be on the offensive. I don't think I can be on the offensive, I need to be on the defensive right now. And even still, I don't know if I can afford to be on the I I don't know, I don't even know if I can afford to defend. The texture at the bottom is saving me and it really shouldn't need to be saving me. And now there's this, yay! Yellow balloons, even better. Double shot, give me something to deal with this. What if- I assume if I send these to him, he'll just absolutely demolish them. Yep, thought so. Doing a pretty good job himself. I'm gonna go for cannon ship. I really just need this defense really badly. And I still- I need to get ready to- I need to remember to try to practice with camo balloons on round 12. Even though they're not actually here, they will be. If I was actually in a high arena, you know, if I actually won a few more matches. Ugh, so many things wrong with this right now. So, so many things wrong with this current stage I'm in. Okay, I mean, I could probably go... No, not really. Maybe a pink rush? Like, he's pink and rushing. I don't think so. Like, I feel like he's probably fine. I really do need to just sit down for a bit, see if I can get a better defense for the long run to try to beat him then. I think that's my best bet. Like, he's doing random pinks. Maybe that's the best thing for Eco. I don't know. Let's try it with Eco. Uh, I'm actually gonna go for a camo detection cannon ship. Uh, and then I will- actually, I made them leak some lives there with those pinks. I didn't mean to, but I did, so that's kind of cool. That was very strange. Game just sort of paused there for a second. Um, he doesn't have camo protection, but obviously I can't take advantage of that, because there's no camo balloons right now, because I'm in such a low arena still. Very, very sad. Okay, um, pink zebra rush? Let's do some pink zebra rush. Pink zebras, I can do this pretty well. And in fact, I did do this pretty well, except he's still... Actually, no, he's so low on lives. He's at 17 lives. He's gonna be even less. Eight lives. I refuse to lose to eight lives. I refuse to lose to eight lives. That's just unacceptable. Uh, Rainbow Rush. No ability, no boosted Rainbow Rush. That can leak him like six lives. Come on, he's dead. Victory is ours. I'm a lot better at the offensive than defensive, I think. I think I need to get better at defending. Because, <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty good at rushing. I know a decent amount about rushing, and now on Yellow Stadium, which means everything is so much more complicated now. <laughs> I didn't even realize for so long that they were sort of, like, making the game easier for you on purpose. But now we're in Yellow Stadium, and... Yeah, Camo Balloons! Oh, the balloon bonds are locked. And now I can lose trophies! I didn't even realize I couldn't even lose trophies. Uh, th these mods can help you win more easily, but beware, they will be more expensive to send, and of course your opponent's access to them too. Oh no. Well, okay, time to probably lose. I can't open a chest, can I? I can't. These are so expensive now, they increase their costs. We're doing one match here, where I'll hopefully do half decently. I need to remember. Camo purples! Camo purples is a good rush, but I also need to be prepared for the rush myself. Um, I really- I don't know about your village. 
I don't know about you, village, but I don't know what I'd replace it with. There's nothing really good I'd replace it with. Banana farms? I could replace it with banana farms, but they're just not as good as eco, I don't think. I will sit still with what I have for now. Do this. this dude has a golden bow. Oh, he's a VIP. Does a VIP give you a golden bow, or did he actually get the golden bow? I don't know. It looks really cool. Does VIP give you those, like, orange name, too? Probably. Probably. VIP. I guess there's nothing real wrong with it. In my mind, it's this evil thing, but it's it's not that big of a deal. Just more money to start off. It makes the game faster at the beginning, which just means I need to, to grind more to make up for it. Okay, come on, match, start. I get it. I'm battling this dude. He's a cool kid. Now let me go in. Okay, that took a while. Um, right, modifiers. Yay. Okay, so then it's oh, I'm so weird. It feels like it's been forever since I've been on this side of the screen. Like forever, forever until I've been on this side of the screen. Going with a doubtling gun. Interesting strategy. Decent strategy, I guess. I mean, I can't keep up with threads. Doubtling boomerang. Okay. Very interesting to start with two towers instead of starting, or at least trying to go for here. I'm assuming that means he's person's probably using Gwendolyn. Uh, obviously, Buccaneers, or not Buccaneers, um, Boomerang's pretty good towers in this game. Like, even just their low tier forms, uh, since they have high, such, such high pierce. Uh, I am also gonna go for, I think, a Tax Sprayer here. I think that probably makes the most sense. It's a really good tower on this map. There's lots of good crows for the tax shooter. Am I gonna leak a red balloon? I better not leak a red balloon. I didn't. Good. This map is pretty long, but it's hard to tell for sure. And uh, I don't want to leak unnecessary lives, so there we go. Tax burger in place should do a good job for probably up to blue balloons. We should be good for a bit to invest more in eco, which is good. Because I want this to be a game where I'm getting eco. Still, no hero. That's odd. It's getting pretty late for a hero with your own three already. You could definitely have afforded the hero. Hero's a good defense. And he's probably saving for a blade ricochet, come to think of it. But still, it's a little odd. A little bit odd. There is also round 8 regens, which could be really, really powerful with the, like, zebra thing I was doing. It would be really good there, too. I guess I'll save, just, like, keep saving money, go for the eco spam. And if I need to, I can always drop a buccaneer if I need the extra defense. This map's really long, which is nice. It's a very easy map. Uh, you know what? I'll just, I'll drop the buccaneer. It's a little early for it. I probably don't need to bother with it. I'll just go grape shot. It won't go all the way to cannon ship. And we'll see how well it goes. Uh, cause I wanna have- I wanna be safe, but I don't wanna be that safe. Oh wait, so they did go with Lave Ricochet, yeah. Lave Ricochet, very powerful tower, definitely gonna be fine against what I sent against him normally. Uh, he could probably lose right now to, like, a bunch of whites, but... <laughs> I'm not gonna really try anything like that. His defense is pretty good. He's probably fine. I'll just keep sending Eco, which he's still sending blue balloons, which either means he doesn't think he can, or doesn't know. Yeah, probably doesn't know. Uh, cause now he's sending green balloons, makes sense. Blade Ricochet, really, really good. Okay, uh, cannon ship definitely needs to happen here. I should be fine for now, but I need those extra defense. Sucks, I lose a little bit of eco, but the defense is pretty necessary, and it will help a lot. Again, it's probably keeping me around for yellows and stuff, too, if he can go for that. I have no idea if he'll have enough eco for it, but if he can, that's, that's something. <laughs> cannon ship, powerful tower, not quite as good as Blade Ricochet, but... Um, also a lot cheaper and can get camo detection much easier, which is good. I could try some yellows, but probably just two-shot them, because it's the fire blade who do two damage. He's sending some yellows. Interesting. Do I need to be worried? Um, huh. I don't need to be worried worried, but I am going to go for another cannon ship. Because I think I need to be worried enough. Uh, so yeah, just, just another cannon ship in the works, nothing too crazy, I'm not gonna go for it that quickly, but I'll keep that in mind as something I need to be doing, saving for a cannon ship. Uh, because I, I want to save them because I want to go for both of them camo protection and probably rush them with camos. He does have Gatling Gunner, which does have camo protection, but not a ton of camo protection, so, you know. Do I try to just set, see what happens if I send some zebras in here? I am gonna send a couple zebras, just to see what happens. We'll throw in some pinks in there as well. Uh, nothing that bad now. Nah. Plus he- Oh, he's went village too. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So camo balloons will not really be a problem for him. He can pop the purple balloons. He's gonna be someone losing to ceramics, if I had to guess. Uh, which again, pretty good. Sounds pretty good. Can I get one some pinks here? I'd love to do some pink eco. It's so much more efficient. It's just way more expensive to do. Uh, I am gonna go for the second cannon ship first, though. I wanna have that. 
Uh, and then I'm probably good. Also, Regen Zimbros, he's already leaking to the pink balloons, which wasn't even meant to be a rush. Um, okay, wasn't planning on it, but you know what I'm gonna do? He does have them, but you know what he doesn't have? Regen Zebra protection! Woo! Lot of Regen Zebras, dude. I have a feeling this might cause a few issues for you. Not super sure, but I have just a small feeling that you are dead. Regens are nice. Piece of cake. It's gonna be a bit of learning curve now that I have access to these. I have to remember that camo balloons exist, regen balloons exist, they're dangerous, they're powerful. But at the same time, I think I'm gonna be pretty good with them. I think I'm gonna do a pretty decent job. Uh, so I'm actually probably gonna multiply this. Uh, but thank you all for watching. I hope you had a wonderful day. Enjoy the video. Consider giving the video a like if you did. Thank you for watching to the end of this BC Battles 2 video. I really want, I've been pushing a lot for this, uh, series to stay strong. I want this to be a series. I think I'm gonna have fun with this series, especially after we get out of the early game, which basically means after I buy every upgrade, which I have no idea how long that's gonna take, but eventually that's gonna happen. So yeah, uh, I'll, I'll be working on that. I am actually gonna do some grinding for next time. Maybe even come in with the fourth tier, we'll see. I don't really know what fourth tier I'll try to get. Uh, but we'll see. I might end up with some fourth tiers for next time. Would be pretty exciting. Uh, I'd probably go for the carrier, not carrier flagship, just the flagship though. So we'll see. Uh, but yeah, thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful day and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye!